We're in a period of active expansion and growth. We're creating new programs, new rotations, we're adding new faculty, uh, we're building and we're changing and evolving and we have very high aspirations. I think it's exciting and uh, why many of us are here, uh, there's an opportunity to be part of that here. Toledo, Ohio may be a smaller city, but I think we have a lot to offer. The nephrology program can provide all uh, the latest uh, nephrology care that a uh, renal patient needs. And uh, also that uh, we have a very active um, uh, transplant program and a uh, lot of clinical trials and transplantation that goes on here. The University of Toledo Department of Nephrology is like a family. I feel like when I come in that I'm the only patient in the world that they have. Uh, the, the care is so concentrated, it's hard to kind of put it into words. You feel like you're part of something big. One of the ways that the University of Toledo Division of Nephrology has helped make the world a better place is its partnership with the Alliance for Pair Donation. The Alliance for Pair Donation has really been one of the leading innovators in living donor kidney transplantation over the last decade. And its innovations have led, I think it's fair to say, to more than 5,000 kidney transplants around the world that wouldn't have otherwise been produced. The University of Toledo Division of Nephrology is very active in translational research. In particular, we've been active in uremic cardiomyopathy as well as glomerular diseases. Our laboratory studies a class of steroid hormones that, that uh, control salt and water balance in the body. The diseases of heart failure and kidney failure are linked by the maladaptation of the body to handle salt and water. So we're interested primarily in the ability of the body to synthesize these hormones, how these hormones are regulated, uh, and what are the therapeutic targets that are presented by these hormones so that we can come up with uh, novel diagnostic and therapeutic and preventative measures targeted specifically on these hormones uh, to help people who have cardiorenal syndrome, the, the failure of both hearts and, and kidneys. Here is a multidisciplinary collaboration. So the research here can have a great breakthrough very quickly. So, so far, multiple novel therapies has been successfully tested and uh, validated in our lab through the in vivo and in vitro disease models. And all these novel therapies are ready for clinical trial very soon. The, there's a lot of very impressive work going on here uh, in, across all departments, in the Department of Medicine, uh, particularly in the Department of Medical Microbiology and Immunology and Transplant Immunology. Uh, we have a really great core structure here with a lot of investigators doing cutting edge work. Recently, the University of Toledo has signed an affiliation agreement with the ProMedica hospital system in Toledo. This has allowed us to have an increase in patient referrals for clinical research as well as patient care. Through the affiliation, uh, we have uh, uh, common interests to improve both the clinical services uh, for the patients in this community and also to advance the academic mission to advance education and research. Uh, under the affiliation, Toledo Hospital is becoming our main teaching hospital. We currently take two fellows per year in a two-year fellowship. An additional year for critical care medicine is also available for those that are interested. Because of the uh, academic affiliation largely, we've had a, a, a huge increase in opportunity, uh, both clinically and also resources, in order to grow and expand programs here. We really want to become a uh, top-tier, high-performing academic medical center and institution. In my view, at least, the stars are aligned and, and we're on the pathway to do that.